The BioSTL building is where all of our programs, centering around startups, capital, people, place, policy, inclusion, global connectedness, all come together under one roof. BioSTL is now almost two decades old, and when we were started by our founder, Dr. William Danforth, in 2001, he recognized St. Louis did not have an infrastructure or ecosystem to capitalize on the great science that we have here. So we tell a great story about BioSTL, the biogenerator, but what makes it really tangible is when those people then come over to St. Louis, and when they see this place, it makes that story real. It can accommodate research done by a really broad spectrum of companies. Some are in therapeutics, some are in medical devices, some are in diagnostics. If it weren't for BioSTL and Biogenerator, Canopy simply would not exist. Biogenerator was with us from day one. Had it not been Biogenerator, you know, and having this great ecosystem and infrastructure, the cortex, I probably would have left. So for any innovation district, it's the bricks and mortar, the buildings, the special amenities are important, right? But what really drives the value proposition is an offering like BioSTL. You have a lot of choices to say, where's the best place in the world for me to build my business? And with something like what BioSTL has become, it is a heart of a value proposition of a place like Cortex. We can see companies doing work. We can see companies having meetings. We can have our young people come to the building and understand that when they're at school and they're doing their lab work or when they're at the Girl Scouts and they're hearing about science, that it leads to real jobs and to real companies and to real opportunities. I say all the time that a room is just a rectangle. And so it can literally be anything. The more we can sort of live that and build the space so it can constantly change, the better we can solve problems on an ongoing basis. We are indebted to Washington University and its leadership for having the vision to make this building available to be converted into this epicenter of bioscience for St. Louis. We had a very large building that it took a lot of vision to see how to reuse, and I think they did a great job of doing it. It's very cool to be in a building that 90 years ago was the home to cutting-edge innovation for the St. Louis Post-Dispatch. And that was very innovative at that time. And now, BioSTL is very innovative in bringing so many new products, new research, new jobs, new energy to St. Louis. It's a privilege to come into this building every day, working alongside individuals and startups who are developing cures for disease and working to solve some of the most difficult world challenges. And the fact that all that amazing activity is centered in this new BioSTL building makes a statement and puts a marker down that St. Louis is not just an emerging leader in the biosciences, but we are today, now, a leader in bioscience innovation.